Have you guys ever joined a DC public server, low on food, struggling to survive, and have no idea what you should be doing? Well then this video is for you. Welcome to Dean's Ultimate Mega Guide. In the Dean's Ultimate Mega Guide, you will learn the five stages of survival. New, observe, obtain, base, and salvation. Follow these steps and you will become the greatest DST pro. In this stage, run around and explore. You will find all kinds of crazy stuff. Oh sh Oh hey look! We found stuff! What is all this? Man, there's so much food. In this stage, observe your surroundings. Public service have unique and natural set pieces. Just like this naturally spawned mega base that I found after a little observing. And now at this point, it's now time to observe your observed observations observationously. In this stage, obtain the stuff you observed so you can make your own base. That's why I made this hammer here so I can collect the stuff I broke down. But don't be too greedy, you're not the only player in the game. So make sure you leave some for other players. Wow. Look at all these beautiful resources. Beautiful resources. Just for me. Well, time to pick everything up. And after obtaining all the resources you can get, it's time to make your base. Pick a base location where it's easy to get to all the major biomes. But since my world gen is complete doo-doo, I made my base on a boat. Boats are super easy to get around the map, and you can build anything you want. Oh my goodness. Look at that beautiful, beautiful water. Man, I just love camping at sea. It's really easy out here. And after a few days when you're satisfied with your base layout, it's finally time for step five, salvation. People like to think that there isn't an endgame in DST, and that's just not true. So how do we get to the endgame? Take your airplane that you should have made somehow from one of the previous steps, and learn to fly the damn thing. Eventually, you should find a big fucking hole in the middle of the sea, have your airplane go through it, and you will be in Don't Start Together, but in 3D. Now when you load in, you should still be in your plane. Now all we gotta do is fly over to this oddly familiar looking portal here, go through it, and... Congratulations idiots, you have now successfully beaten not only Don't Start Together, but also Don't Start Together in 3D. But if you guys enjoyed this Minecraft video, go ahead and leave a like, smash that like button, and subscribe, and I will do absolutely nothing for you.